Yeah, I'll come with you. So, so I'm at the police station right now. I probably really know what's happening, but they stole my truck this morning, you know what I mean? Stole my truck, man, a couple days before Christmas, man. Super sad, man. Super sad right now, I ain't gonna lie, man. I hustle hard, man, for these kids and stuff, man. Barely trying to make it for Christmas. It's just rough, man. It's sad, man. I don't know what the fuck to say, man. I'm trying my hardest to make it right now, like. It's just sad, man. I don't know what to say. Maybe I'm at the police station right now, though. I'm finna make this report. I'm gonna get a child in a minute, man. But cross our fingers for your boy, man. I just want my truck back, man. Like, I need my truck for my kids, for my family, man. It's sad, man. I'm barely making it the last couple of days was critical, man. Getting these gifts, but we was on point, man. And come outside today and straight home, man. And they stole it right out of my stall. Right out of my stall. Because the gate been broke. It's crazy, man. Drove it right out of the building. I'm sad right now, man. How you doing, man? I'm sad, though. Hey, yeah, man. Please hurry, y'all. Uh, longer they wait for me to report my truck stolen, the longer the motherfuckers got out there to be driving my shit or doing anything with my shit. I'm praying to God it's just somebody high and driving around joyriding in my shit. I'm praying to God if that's what happens, man. I'm praying to God that's what happens. That somebody would just hide, enjoy riding in my truck, and still in it. God, please, man. I need my truck, man. God, please. I'm begging you, God. Please, let me get my truck back. I'm praying. I'm begging you, God. Not even for me, for my kids. Not for me. I'm here to report my uh, truck stolen. Stolen? Yes. No, I have my my owner. The owner has video of the people coming in the building stealing it. Oh, so there's video? Yeah. Okay. Do you have that video? No. But can you, have you seen it or anything? No, I haven't got a chance to see it yet. They've been coming in and out of our, our gate is broke, so they've been break, coming in there, breaking into cars the last couple of months. This time they stole my truck. It was parked inside of my building. The address, would you like? That's true, it's hot. Yeah, it is. Was it hot in the stall? Yeah, in the stall. Do you know the number? I'm not sure my stall number. I just have my apartment number. Do you know if it's corresponding with your apartment number? Or is I don't think it corresponds with the apartment number. Okay. Um, do you have your ID with you? Yes, ma'am. And can I get your license? Sure. This is my information right here for my vehicle. Okay. <sighs> I think I spoke to you earlier over the phone. Yeah. Uh, when they came in the building and... No cameras? Yeah, we do have cameras. The owner, he has the camera footage, but he's at work right now. Both plates on there? Yeah, both plates. This is the second time they stole it. Same yeah. one? I'm sorry. Yeah, same vehicle. Get a load club or something. I don't know. Yeah, got to figure it out, this man. This is a record year for stolen cars. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's the most we've ever had. Wow. So, it's a lot. Sad. We got license plate readers throughout the city, so once we put it in the system, uh, as soon as it goes through, our officers will get immediate uh, flag and we'll see what we'll find out. Okay. So, we'll see. Appreciate it. All right, good luck to you. Thank you, sir. And you said it was a GMC Yukon? Yes, ma'am. What color? Blue. And is it like a SUV or a four door, or two door? It's a four, four door. Four door.
sure. Well, obviously, y'all say I'm back at the house. Back at the hazy. Chilling. Made that police report. Hopefully, my truck come back. You know what I mean? Hopefully, my truck come back. Shit. Hopefully, my truck come back. And if it do, I know it ain't gonna have my radio. It's crazy, too, because yesterday, I just... You didn't hear it yesterday, but you could, yesterday I just threw the Bluetooth on with my, with my shit. That shit was beating so hard and nice. Just yesterday on the way back. It was beating so hard and so, so nice. Sometimes I wondered if the wrong person hear my shit. It was beating so hard and so nice with it. What you call it with the Bluetooth on, not the radio. Where did you play it? Just on the way home. From the gym? Yeah. She's stupid. You should Not like that, but you should have not did that then. At nighttime too, motherfuckers out looking for shit. Hey, my shit was bad too. At nighttime too, it was dark too. Motherfuckers just out looking for stuff like that. They probably waited for you to come in. They seen a chance and they probably just said, okay, we're going to come at this and, and hit that. Oh, I think it's just probably them same motherfuckers. I think it's just probably them same motherfuckers who came the first time. I think it's that same group of people. I really do. But anyway, man, I'm back at the house, man. I'm sad in the motherfucker. I ain't going to lie. Saturday in the motherfucker because I can't do shit. We can't do shit. We can't go nowhere. We can't do shit. We can't do nothing, man. We can't go nowhere. And we were just on point with the Christmas yeah, shopping. Yeah, we was. Today we're just going to get the clothes and then figure out the last two days what we can do to clean it up. And now look, this shit fucked it all the way up. It was already enough. It was already making it hard and figure some shit out. Now it really just throw us off. No, now it's really just like... And like Carlos said, hopefully... They don't steal your catalytic converter because that's what I said. Not, it didn't take Carlos to say that. I said that from a oh, joke too. I didn't hear you, but I'm saying. Of course, like, that's what I said. Yeah. Hopefully, they don't steal the catalytic. That's that just brand, brand new. new. Yeah, that, you had just got that shit on there. You're just trash, man. I'm thirsty. You're just trash, but anyway, I'm back at the house. Y'all see, you know, I made that report. You know what I mean? You're just trash, man. It's sad, man. I ain't gonna lie, man. This is the second time they stole my truck. Last time it lasted like almost fucking a month without the truck. Was it that long? Yes. They what? stole that shit in June and we didn't get it back I to thought like... it was like the Christmas time. No, in June. It was summer. That's why it I was, was so summer. high. We was in here miserable. I remember. They stole that, that shit in June something. We didn't get that shit till like August. Like the first of August or some shit like that. And the only reason why we got it back because of that fucking ticket that came home. Yep. That is true. Because that ticket that came... So, man, with that being said, man, I'm really feeling even more sad. I want my, man, I hope I get my truck back. I feel so fucked up, man. Shit, you are just I'm excited. We're going to get this day off early and I don't see it. You sure you locked your truck? Yes, I always make sure I lock my shit. I remember locking it. I remember locking my shit. It's like they had it planned already. Like I think it's that fucking same old motherfucker that the police took the other day. Cause all they do it's not him. He went to jail. They, baby, they let them out real baby, quick. Baby, he was in a stolen truck. Oh. He was in a stolen truck already. Well, it's the same group or something. That's what I said already. Yeah. Oh, you behind, baby. I'm telling I said that already. I said that already. It's the same group of people. And overall, they got my goddamn truck, man. So, anyway, man, yeah. I'll make the police report and, um... Shit, hopefully I get my shit back. You know what I mean? And then in the midst of that... They got this day. All right, we not paying no rent next month. That's still ain't Yeah. No, I need my money for my truck. I need a truck. I want my truck back. I need my money for my truck. That ain't right. I can't, I can't sit here and just... That ain't right. That ain't our fault. No. I need to talk to Matt. That's who I need to talk to. It's crazy. And he not answering either. Yeah. Yeah, they don't want to talk. All right, y'all. So it's a little later on in the day, man. Not a little later on. It's later on in the day. As y'all can see, it's nighttime, man. And um, I'm just going to upload this quick video, man. Hopefully some of y'all out there see the video living in L.A. and shit like that. And hopefully Compton and, we, and, and, and just some close areas, Inglewood. LA, you know what I mean? Hopefully y'all can just keep a lookout for my truck because y'all already know that nigga grind. Y'all already know what it is with me, man. I don't do nothing but take care of these kids and they ain't really got nothing to do with it anyway, you know what I mean? Because it wasn't no personal thing with these niggas who stole my truck. They were just trying to steal the truck. Or not just trying to steal the truck because they definitely 
came from my truck, you know what I mean, they definitely came from my truck, so, it's just messed up, you know what I mean, but I know it happens to everybody, I'm not no different from nobody else, you know what I mean, but it's just messed up the timing, because, man, it's already rough enough getting my Christmas, this Christmas out of the way, which I was doing, that's no problem, like I told y'all, or I didn't tell y'all in this video, I mean, the bread is there for that, you know what I mean, and it's still rough, you know what I mean, but I was able and capable to do it, you know what I mean, so, it just felt good to be able to do it this year without having some help, you know what I mean, after, <clears throat> the last couple of years but just to go outside and see my truck stolen and you know what i mean now i can't even finish the last two three days uh shopping i was supposed to do it today and then the last two days that was critical i really needed that you know what i mean we was already behind on it but we was getting it done so saturday was just gonna come together and be so right you know what i mean so i actually got video footage of the motherfuckers who stole it you know what i mean but i can't really tell the license plate number because it's so blurry but um yeah that's what it is so i'm just gonna post a video hoping hopefully y'all see it you know what i mean um and if you do, y'all know how to get at me, man. Y'all can get at me here, Mr. McSwag, wherever, you know what I mean? But, um... It's messed up, man. My baby gone. Gotta wake up in the morning, then. Now I have my truck, man. That shit hurts, man. Shit hurts, man. It really does. But y'all, man, I guess you guys just making room for something better for me, you heard? And my family, you know what I mean? Because it ain't just me. It's family vehicle. It's the only car we got, man. You know what I mean? We can't do nothing no more. We got to figure out how to go to the store. We got to figure out how to do everything. And this ain't the first time we've been, we've been through this already. They stole my truck like four years ago. The same truck they stole this time. They stole it like four... Years ago, it took like a month to get my truck back, but I got it back, but it's just messed up, man, because that was some of the roughest times. I tell people, like, that was some of the roughest times, man, when they had stole my truck, man. We was in here miserable, and now we finna go through it again. It's gonna be different, because I'm gonna, you know what I mean? I'm just gonna keep on pushing to the end of the day, because that's all I know how to do, you know what I mean? I can never let nothing or nobody knock me down, you know what I mean? Temporarily, the feeling, okay, it's natural, you know what I mean? It's natural. Somebody stole my truck, my baby. Had that motherfucker for a couple of years, you know what I mean? And my shit was just getting right, you know what I mean? My beat was just getting right. Just yesterday, I was banging my shit and so proud of it. You know what I mean? The way it was sounding because somebody had just... I mean, actually, I had just blew a speaker and shit like that. Y'all know how I go with my truck if y'all fuck with the channel, man. It's a work in progress. I ain't been able to work on it as much because... You know what I mean? I just be busy, man. Just keeping an eye on these kids, you know what I mean? But, um... But it's my baby, though, you know what I mean? And... Just got a new catalyst on that bitch, you know what I mean? I didn't did the alternator on that bitch. I didn't did a lot of stuff on my truck, you know what I mean? So I'm proud of my truck. The outside don't really look as good as I would want it to, but you know, that's my baby, man. I'm gonna get it from here to there. And like I said, it's Christmas time too. Christmas three days away from now, so it's gonna be rough. It's gonna be a sad Christmas for your boy, you know what I mean? But I believe in God and I know God gonna come through for me. Like I said, if I don't get my truck back, I know something better gonna come and bigger. Stop playing with me because at the end of the day, can't nothing, can't nobody. Stop me. Stop playing with me. I'm going to tell y'all just like that. It is what it is. And I'm sad in the motherfucker right now. But I can sit here and tell you that. You know what I mean? Can't nothing. Can't nobody stop me. You know what I mean? Not even no punk ass smokers who stole my truck. I wish I could catch their ass though. You know what I mean? I don't mean to be sounding no funny way on here though. But I really wish I could put hands on their ass. You know what I mean? Real talk. I really do. But that's beside the point though. You know what I mean? And, and at the end of the day maybe. I don't know why. Because sometimes we don't really understand why. Because I question God, but they said not to question God. But maybe it was just meant to happen because we went to the police station to make that report. I'm not sure if y'all heard, but it was a lady in front of me, you know what I mean, who was going hysterical about her daughter, you know what I mean? She had a fight with her and this and that, and her daughter been wilding out, 13, 14-year-old girl. And uh, she ran out the house. She followed her, followed her daughter a little and, and kind of lost view of her, so she was so worried. So she panicked. She came to the police station and was just panicked and kind of having an anxiety attack damn near, you know what I mean? Because uh, she didn't know where her daughter was. She was worried and she was saying she didn't want nobody to find her daughter in that state. You know what I mean? Her daughter was already going through depression here and there and shit like that. And you know what I mean? She was just hysterical and wondering where her daughter was at. But she ended up leaving or whatever, you know what I mean? And it just so happened on my way back home, I spotted the girl. I remember me and my son spotted the girl. And I remember she had said the girl had some yellow socks on, you know what I mean? And some Nike sandals. So spotted her, you know what I mean? Called the police, followed the girl. Police came and got her, so hopefully tonight she back with her family, you know what I mean? And um, hopefully they're having a good night, you know what I mean? And hopefully uh, that young girl, you know what I mean, can kind of 
uh, get her mind right and kind of learn to appreciate her parents and her 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 mom or whatever it is. I don't know what they're going through, but the mom seems like to be a good lady. But hopefully she can get home, appreciate and have a better night, a good night. You know what I mean? A better night than what we having, I guess. Even though our night is cool, you know what I mean? We're just missing our truck, you know what I mean? It's like a family member, you know what I mean? It's like losing a family member, real talk. Like, I feel for my truck, you know what I mean? Somebody sitting there abusing my truck right now and not really taking care of it or appreciating my shit, you know what I mean? Just had my $500 radio. Really, $600. We paid $500 for my radio in there. You know what I mean? Had a couple of personal things in there. Our family basketball in there. So, it's just trash, man. It really is just trash. But, um... Overall, man, it is what it is. I can't do nothing about it. Uh, I just want to make put this video out there so y'all can know, know. And if anybody see my truck, you know what I mean? Y'all know got the logo in the back. A&M Dream Chase. I'm going to put some pictures on here right now. If y'all see my shit, just let me know. You know what I mean? Please. You know what I mean? DM me. Get at me and Mr. Miss Swag. And uh, like I said, man, hopefully my truck come back. Uh, I wish it could come back to me by tomorrow or soon. I know that ain't going to happen because I got some shit to do, but... Like I said, I'm going to keep on moving no matter what, you know what I mean? Because that's just what a do nigga do. That's all I know how to do. And that's just what it is at the end of the day, you know what I mean? Nigga just not just sit here and be sad and, you know what I mean? And just mourn and fuck all that shit. Nigga just got to keep on going, you know what I mean? It's going to keep on hitting my brain because it do. And I am sad, but nigga just got to keep on pushing because Christmas is two days away. And I got to make sure these kids is happy no matter what. So, for the most part, I got most of their shit. And I'm going to try to figure out how I can get the rest. And if not, baby, just shoot them some bread and let them know. They already see what it is, man. But, um... Yeah, y'all check out the video. If y'all ain't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel, man. I got some new goals coming, you know what I mean? I want to get at least like 10 to 20 subscribers a week on this channel, you know what I mean? And they got to set goals in order to make shit happen, you know what I mean? So y'all make sure y'all keep that in mind, man. If y'all got a dream or something out there, you won't achieve that dream or nothing like that until you set goals. You got to set little goals to reach certain points, you know what I mean? To know that you're advancing and you're getting progress. Other than that, if you're not getting progress, you just got a dream, you know what I mean? And you're not really acting on it. So make sure y'all get active with y'all dreams, you know what I mean? Because that's something I'm focusing on this year, too. So happy holidays to y'all, man. Y'all cross your fingers. Wish me luck. Y'all check out this video, man. If something ring a bell, you know what I mean? Or something like that. You know what I mean? Like I said, get at your boy. You already know what it is, boy. Ask, man. I'll holler at y'all on the next one, man. Yeah. Happy holidays, though. <clears throat>